What is going on? Radar Force. Oh, speaking of Radar Force. You freaking have a freaking radar now, bro. This is totally off subject here, but this is the team this is the channel mascot now. Oh look at this, look at this, look at this, look at this. Oh look at this. Oh they're all seven on the game. And I'm gathering them all. Oh yeah, anyways. Shut up. A uh, collection freaking update. Um that was an intro for one. It's doing its thing over there. Uh, it'll probably be talking for a minute. But anyways, collection update. Uh, most of these are video game related. So, I originally didn't want to count these for my collection because the main things I wanted were releases that had uh, UPC codes in the back that you could actually buy in stores. Uh, but technically you can buy these in stores. Technically, is that... Yeah, you can count them. So, anyways, um, a guy hit me up and he was, uh, he saw my collection and I asked him if there was anything that he thought I was missing. And there was, there were a few things. Uh, most of the, most of his, the stuff he listed, um, I ended up getting besides, I believe, two things, two things. Yeah, two, I was missing two things, uh, from that list. So I got all but those two. And uh, yeah, here they are. So first, I'm going to go over the. Uh, uh, let's see. We'll go over the Budokai 3 uh, exclusive bonus DVD. Nothing special about it. It came with the Budokai 3 uh, limited edition. I just got, you can buy this really easy online. I just bought it uh, without the game because with the game it's super rare. And like I said, I don't care for the games. I only care for uh, the DVDs. Uh, in here is just interviews and stuff of the uh, Funimation cast and all that. So it's really nothing to do with uh, home video like episodes or anything so really it's up to you if you want to count it uh, i went ahead and got it so no one can like say well you forgot this and this and that and that and this so i got it oh by the way the back's pretty cool uh, anyway so i got that that's probably the least favorite uh next is this dvd here which is uh dragon ball z best fights um uh, and this is just covers about like five or six fights uh it's kind of like the uh best uh of vegeta fights and stuff like that but instead of full episodes it's like random little snippets of each fight uh and this also came in the budokai this is a game release that came with the budokai tenkaichi 3 includes bonus disc uh i took it out of the case because i'm gonna i'm gonna find a sleeve for it and put it in that but that is another uh that is another uh dvd release if you want to count like i said if you if you want to count it because it comes with the game this game is actually super rare for the PS2. It's like 125 bucks. Luckily, the Wii version is like 40 bucks, so you can pick it up if you just want the DVD uh, instead of having to like freaking pay 125 bucks just for the PS2 version with the same DVD. That's up to you if you like games. You might want the PS2 version, but that's strictly up to you. Uh, next is another game release, which is the Game Boy Advance Video, which I'm not sure. I guess this is a cartridge. I haven't busted it open. It's sealed actually. Oh, this is actually also fairly easy to find, but this includes two episodes of Dragon Ball GT, A Grand Problem, and Pan's Gambit. Um, it's a pretty cool thing. It's for the Game Boy Color, but it's got the two episodes on the back. So this is definitely a home video release. This one, this one, I don't care who you are, I'd have to count that one because it is home video and actually shows uh, anime stuff. Like, that one, I definitely, I mean, I count it, but at the same time, I don't care if you have it or not. That one actually has anime in it, so probably count it probably count it uh the next are these right here these are the uh official strategy guides this is issue one and issue one is really hard to find with the dvd inside i'm going to turn the camera uh luckily i found it though after searching for a few hours but yeah it comes with uh, a dvd it's hard to find with the dvd for issue one but it comes with uh episode 22 of dragon ball gt and a bunch of like trailers for random anime even on this one it has like the broly uh feature trailer but yeah it's got the dvd in there and this is for the legacy of goku 2 i think it's a game boy game uh issue two is uh the budokai drama budokai uh and it comes with the second disc this one is fairly easy to find i think but yeah this one comes with uh uh dragon ball gt episode 35 
And like I said, more trailers and stuff. Uh, issue three is uh, <coughs> Dragon Ball Z Taiketsu, I guess. Uh, this one's, I think, I believe this one's fairly easy. Uh, <coughs> I'm not sure. All I really had problem finding was uh, issue one with the disc. Uh, and issue three comes with uh, uh, Dragon Ball GT episode 41 and more uh, random trailers. And then issue four and the last issue. Budokai 2, really good game. Oh, this one's really easy to find, I believe. Uh, issue 4 comes with Dragon Ball GT Episode 43, and more trailers. Yay. That covers the magazines. Uh, next one is this super dumb uh, movie double feature of Battle of Gods and Resurrection F. Um, it looks bootleg as heck, but I kid you not, it is a Walmart special, and it... I saw this and I was like, that's totally like from Europe, but it actually is, it's got its own UPC code, and down here it's region, region one, so that's America and United States, and yeah, I kid you not, and funny enough, let me show you the back here, funny enough, so here's a spine, the spine, I like the spine, it, it stands out, but funny enough, the, uh, the disc inside are actually from the, uh, Battle of the Gods uncut normal release and the Resurrection F disc. So they're the same disc that you'd buy in uh, the standard releases that Funimation put out. But the only difference is it's in a double pack, which I am so glad they made. But it looks super stupid. But it's actually really hard to find, so good luck. And here's another super hard to find uh, DVD. Uh, it's, it's another super dumb one, but it's the Best of Vegeta in the black case. So... You may be thinking, well, this is easy to find, but there's actually two releases. This is the Black Case, which was the first release of uh, The Best of Vegeta. They re-released it into uh, a clear case, which I have right here. Uh, the clear case, I mean, everything looks the same, but actually, there is a slight difference on the spine with just the, uh, the numbers down here. Nothing on the top, but right here, on the Black Case version, it just has the FN number, and my camera is not focusing. As you can see right there, it has the FN number right here. And on the clear case, it has an extra set of numbers on the bottom. Uh, that is a clear giveaway. Also on the back, I've, I've studied this. Uh, on the black case, the ISBN number and all the way across is bold. Over here, it's not. It's the same as that. And some of the like text down here is obviously different. But the easiest way to determine it is obviously the black case and the... Uh, spine right here but i mean just in case like someone actually just breaks the clear case and puts the insert in a black case you'll be able to know by this the, the uh insert so that's just something i wanted to point out there for people trying to find it in the future so like if someone just like puts the insert in a black case and says oh it's the black case one well dead giveaway is the spine but yeah that is the black case and i want to bring out the other one so as you know the first release was goku and that one came in a black case too which this one I have open. The rest I have sealed, luckily enough. Not that it really matters, but I have the uh, uh, all of them sealed, but the uh, best of Goku. So there is five releases, six if you count, you know, black case. So uh, best of Goku, best of Vegeta black case, best of Vegeta clear case, the super rare um, best of Piccolo. That one's like probably on the same as the best of Vegeta black case. Uh, then we have the uh, the best fights and the best villain fights. And all of them after Vegeta were released in clear cases. So uh, As of right now, that's all the releases of the uh, best of fights or whatever. But yeah, I am really stoked to have that black case one. I mean, as stupid as it sounds, I'm really hyped about it. But other than that, that is the collection update uh, this time around. Uh, I'm missing nine things now, so let's see. I'm missing the uh, Five Warriors edited. VHS. I'm missing the two laser discs, Tree of Might and World Strongest. I'm missing the ultimate edition of uh what is it called? The stupid Dragon Ball movie, um The Magic Begins. Um and what else? I'm missing there's the uh uh Epic Battles for GameCube and PlayStation. A uh, disc that comes with a pre-order, which is, that comes like a disc like that, and uh, super hard to find. I can't find them, but there's two discs. I'm missing those two. 
That brings me up to six. What else am I missing? I'm not sure off the top of my head, but I, I think I'm missing nine things. But yeah. So I was down to like five, and then this guy told me more things I needed. Found those, and now I'm missing nine things. So anyways, that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you. I'll catch you guys on the next update. And one day, we will complete this massive beast of a collection. Peace.